Are you between the ages of 8 and 13? Have you noticed that the clothes you bought just a few weeks ago don't fit? Do your feet seem too big for the rest of your body? Are you concerned about how you look, but not sure you like the way you look? Do you find yourself extremely angry one minute and laughing hysterically just a few minutes later? Then congratulations, you're probably at a stage of your life called puberty. Sooner or later, every girl and boy goes through puberty. Puberty is the name for when your body begins to change and develop. Puberty is a time for lots of emotional changes too. Sometimes puberty can be confusing and it's normal to have lots of questions. It's good to know about the changes that come along with puberty before they happen. So let's talk about the top 10 things you can expect when you go through puberty. What is puberty? Does everyone go through it? What happens? Puberty is the time when your body changes and develops from a kid to an adult. Puberty is something everybody goes through. Here's what happens. In your head, just below your brain, is a small P-shaped gland called the pituitary gland. When the time comes, it releases two hormones. In girls, the chemicals target the ovaries. Since birth, the ovaries have contained eggs. The hormones stimulate the ovaries to begin producing another hormone called estrogen. Estrogen causes a girl's body to mature and prepares her for pregnancy. So, let's review. During puberty, you have all these hormones going through your body, and everybody goes through it. You understand that it's the hormones that turn you from a kid into an adult. When the hormones are released, there's one thing you can expect to happen. Your ovaries will begin producing estrogen, and that changes everything. When does puberty start? When does puberty end? Does it hurt? Someone told me it hurts. For girls, puberty starts sometime between the ages of 8 and 13. Some people start earlier, some start later. Everybody is on a different schedule. During that time, you can go through a growth spurt, a time when your body grows really fast. This growth is the last time your body will grow taller. After that, you'll be at your adult height. So, during puberty, expect to grow taller. One day, I get up and I have this huge pimple on my chin. Is that normal? Does eating chocolate cause acne? Who squeezes it? People say you shouldn't, but my sister does. How do you stop acne? Another thing that comes with puberty is acne, or pimples, often referred to as zits. Hormones that stimulate the production of oil in the skin trigger acne. Do not touch or squeeze the acne. It helps to keep your skin clean. And the good news about acne is that it usually gets better or disappears after adolescence. Why does your body need hair on your legs, underarms, and your private areas? Is that hair really necessary? Is hair supposed to grow everywhere? One of the first signs of puberty is having hair growing in places it didn't grow before. Hair will grow under your arms and in your pubic area your legs and arms. Some girls may want to start shaving their legs right away. Others may want to wait until they're much older or not shave them at all. 
It's different for everyone. Whenever you start, be sure to go slowly. You can cut yourself if you go too quickly. My hair looks like I wash it with oil. It's gross. What is going on? Well, the hormones that create acne can also make your hair oily. Washing your hair every day can help control oily hair. You can also try a conditioner for oily hair. So here's what you need to know. Just about everyone gets pimples or acne. Hair grows in different places all over your body, and your hair will get and feel oily. When do girls begin to grow breasts? My jeans don't fit right anymore. Am I getting fat? As girls go through puberty, they typically gain weight. As they grow, most girls have an increase in body fat. Their hips widen, making their body shape curvier. Girls' breasts also begin to develop. It could start with a little swelling around the nipple. It's important to know that one breast can develop more quickly than the other, but over time, they will usually even out. So it's good to know that eventually everyone gains body fat, and your breasts and your hips will get bigger too. When puberty hits, your body will change a lot. What can you expect? You can expect acne. Expect to grow hair in places that never had hair before. And your hair will get and feel oily. Expect your breasts to develop differently, and expect to gain weight. What happens when you get your period? Will I get cramps? What's PMS? A girl will experience her first menstrual period a couple of years after her breasts begin to develop. Here's what happens: girls have two ovaries, each containing thousands of eggs. During a menstrual cycle, one of the eggs comes out of the ovary and travels through the fallopian tube to the uterus. The uterus has been growing its lining with extra blood and tissue. If the egg is not fertilized by a sperm cell, the uterus doesn't need the extra blood and tissue. It leaves the body through the vagina as a menstrual period, which can last from five to seven days. Two weeks after the start of the cycle, a new egg is released. Lots of times when girls get their period, they can experience cramps or headaches. Most girls have physical and emotional symptoms before they get their periods. It's called premenstrual syndrome or PMS. It can be a real pain, but it's normal and nothing to worry about. How come I sweat so much? I am not a fan of sweating. Do you have to use deodorant? When your body begins to change, your sweat glands become more active, and besides sweat. They also release different chemicals. When the sweat comes in contact with bacteria on the skin, it can produce an unpleasant odor. Your armpits, groin area, and feet can be especially smelly. The best way to combat the odor is to take a bath or shower every day using soap and water. That'll wash off the bacteria. And help you control the way you smell, and it'll make you feel better too. Concerned about your underarm odor? Try using a deodorant or deodorant with antiperspirant. Deodorants cover up the sweat odor. Antiperspirants dry up the perspiration. Deodorants and antiperspirants come in sticks, roll-ons, sprays, and gels. Be sure to read the directions on the label before you use it. So to recap, during puberty, you can expect to have a period every month, and expect cramps and PMS. Expect to get sweaty. 
I'm confused about a lot of stuff. It seems like everything and everybody makes me mad. Am I crazy? The hormones released during puberty affect every part of your body, including your brain. During puberty, you not only get a new body, but you get a new brain, too. You may become easily upset at your family or your friends. Lots of girls have feelings of anxiety about their body, or they're confused with strong emotions they've never had before. During puberty, you can expect to feel new emotions and strange feelings. Your brain is changing too. No two people are the same, and no two people go through puberty the same way. The important thing to know is that eventually, all of those things that make you different will all even out in time. So let's review the 10 things you can expect when going through puberty. 10. Expect your ovaries to begin producing estrogen. 9. Expect to get taller. 8. Expect to get pimples or acne. 7. Expect to grow hair in places that never had hair before. 6. Expect your hair to look and feel oily. 5. During puberty, expect your breasts to develop differently. 4. Expect that you will gain weight. 3. Expect to get a period and perhaps cramps and or PMS. 2. Expect to get sweaty. And the number one thing to expect during puberty? Expect your brain to feel strange. Puberty may sound like it's overwhelming, and at times it can be. But the good news is that you don't have to go through it alone. And when it's all over, you'll be an adult.